120,000 young people in the UK are stateless. Living in these uncertain circumstances are testing times for these young people. In the next few minutes, we're going to learn more about the problem and why it's not being solved. We met Nathan, a 19-year-old from Hansworth, Birmingham, who is a young person currently living in limbo. How does someone born in this country not ain't allowed to get a passport? Well, it stopped me from doing a lot of things. Obviously, going on holiday. I can't get the life experience as well from that I gained from going to different countries. I just say to myself that I'm going to have to get it sooner or later because obviously I was born in this country, so it shouldn't really stop me from getting it. So I feel trapped in England. Six hundred and eighteen thousand migrants live in the UK without authorization. A significant proportion of this is made up of people under the age of eighteen. Irrespective of these situations, children hold certain rights. Irregular migrant children are given some degree of protection but may not gain access to public services. These facts came from a research carried out by the ESRC Centre on Migration, Policy and Society at Oxford University by Dr Nando Singona. We spoke to him about his findings. So what I wanted to explore is our legal status or the lack of legal status, the fact of being undocumented or illegal, and you can use different words to uh, to say the same thing, affects the life of children. It's very hard to deport people, but this doesn't mean that they got the security to be in the country. So the, the, what is more a, a cause of concern for us was this sense of uh, limbo, situation of uh, waiting for something that never happened. So you cannot be deported, but you are never fully part of society. You cannot get rid of these children without legal status. So let's give them a future. When realising how big this problem was, we wanted to know if there was anywhere out there to help these young people and their families. Our research led us to Mohamed Idrish at the Asian Resource Centre in Birmingham. Well, the Asian Resource Centre is a charitable organisation. It provides free advice on immigration, asylum, housing, welfare benefit, debt. We have a lot of people who we work with are deemed as stateless or they don't have any passport. The fear for their future, the fear for their uh, parents' future. The problem of young people living in limbo is not just theirs. It is a problem for the whole of society. We need to give these people an identity they deserve so that they can become contributing members of society.